You have your army. I have mine. One, two, leash is coming for you. Three, four, better close your door. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. This is James in Nashville. And in this video, let's review the trailer for the upcoming 7B of Fear the Walking Dead. So spoiler alert if you're not caught up so far. The trailer opens with Strand in the elevator. He may just be going down to meet Alicia. We see in the rest of the trailer that Alicia shows up at his tower from what it seems and they're having a little meeting. But Strand, you know, he is playing the part for sure. A demented soul in my opinion. I think I heard someone say it best one time when they said the only way to help this person is if you could go back in time and make the father hug them a little more. And here we see Alicia Luciana's finally back in the scene. And we see June, who supposedly is at Strand's Tower, part of Strand, but I guess she gets away. It looks like they're at the stadium. Could this be? Or is this part of Strand's Tower? We haven't seen yet. And here we got Strand's men riding up, everybody with guns pretty much. Uh, John Dory just sitting up there like, yeah, I don't know if I'm on these guys' side or not. And I'm really not. Here we see some of Alicia's people. We see Sarah, um, Dwight, and Sherry. Not sure if they're looking back over at Strand's people riding up to them or what the situation is here. And here we have Morgan. Um, I'm not sure if this is in the sub. We do see some light coming through the windows over there, it looks like. Um, he's sporting his sub t-shirt, as always. It looks like there's a big bag of guns, you know. It looks kind of like Daniel in the shot. And then we see some walker hands and arms trying to get through some doors and it looks like maybe to charlie here and uh does charlie die before madison comes around because there's some tension going to be there if people even tell her how nick died um you know if she asked where's nick and they said he died she would say how did he die well he got shot who shot him i mean you know it's going to get to that if it comes around will alicia be around in that moment where she meets charlie where madison meets charlie because you know you'd think alicia would definitely save Charlie, not let Madison kill her. You'd think Daniel and some of the others would also step up and say, hey, Charlie is one of us. Yeah, she did this bad thing. She was a kid. She was misled. And she's one of us. And Madison, of all people, she's changed, of course, since the beginning of the apocalypse. But, you know, she she helped Tobias there in the beginning. You know, you would think Charlie killed her son. That's a big piece of forgiveness to hand out right there. We got Wes. He's saying, hey, it's over. And Maybe that's him shooting at somebody. Looks like maybe they got some cuffs behind their back or something. Their hands tied running up the stairs. Don't know who that is. Don't know if that's really Wes shooting at him. But we do see Strand on the rooftop. Looks like of his tower. You can see plants on the left side. Uh, the little thing that's holding up the light on the right side maybe. And a fire. So that's not cool. Is this the last showdown? Or uh, what's going on here? It does make you wonder if these scenes that we see here are from the entire second half. Or just the first few episodes. Cool shot of Daniel killing somebody. Uh, one of Strand's people I'm sure. And everyone running to the doors. This looks like it could be uh, the tower. I'm not sure. But then of course everyone shooting. From behind that little uh, telephone stage. That uh, Strand put out there. There's several people you can see there. You got Dwight. And one of Alicia's people maybe there. It could be Morgan. Um, but you got Daniel. You got June. You've got Wendell. Looks like Grace maybe behind Wendell, not sure. And of course, a couple guys on the rooftop returning fire, it looks like, Strand's building. And Alicia there, standing there with Strand, uh, still looking pretty rough. And Strand saying, you've got your armies, I've got mine, and he's on the radio. So there's definitely some fighting. It looks like some people sneak in and rescue some of their people, like June and Wendell. Not sure how much of a war that's been going on or will go on. Uh, a lot of little battle scenes we may see. Not sure about a, a complete war, what's going on, how it will all play out. When Madison will return, I'm sure right at the end of 7B. But fans of the channel know that I'm just not a fan of this season. Um, it hasn't been that great to me. The writing's kind of off, so it's hard to predict. And it's hard to really look at it, you know, really rewatch the episode and try to pull something out of it to, to give you guys and, and show you guys and tell you guys because I don't want to rewatch the episodes once I've watched them uh, like before, you know, um, especially on The Walking Dead and, and stuff like that. I'll rewatch an episode several times. World Beyond made it really hard to rewatch an episode, especially season one. I did rewatch a few on season two, but the latest seasons of Fear the Walking Dead. It's just hard to rewatch an episode to really uh, find that extra clue or maybe figure something out uh, because of what someone said or what someone did. 
As far as this trailer, not a lot of big clues about what happens or on Madison's return or anything like that. I didn't see anything that jumped out at me. It seems to be a funny kind of war. Alicia and Strand, Alicia's standing there saying, then we're going to war. And Strand just sitting up on his horse like, okay. So they're going to war, I guess. And you see Alicia and Strand again in a room talking with each other like, hey, you know, let's just uh, have our people fight and stuff. And we'll just bitch at each other and, and moan and stuff like that. So I'm not sure where it's going. You guys let me know what you think about it, where you think it's going, how you think Madison will return. The video right before this one, you should check it out. It's called Run, Charlie, Run. It's got some theory talk in the video, but the real juice and meat is down in the comments. So if you want to check out what a lot of people are saying, which is some really cool stuff on how they think Madison will return, definitely check out that video and the comments. And as far as Fear 7B, same way with this video. Let me know what you think about it down in the comments, your theories, thoughts, um, everything. Just uh, will Charlie survive, you know, um, all of that stuff. How will it play out? And keep in mind that they will be moving to Georgia to the filming from Texas to Georgia. I think it's Savannah, Georgia. But still, do they get out of Texas away from the nuke stuff? I hope so. By season eight, man, please, please, please get out of the nuke stuff. That's just my opinion. But let me know yours, of course, and I'll join you there in the comments. This is James in Nashville. As always, thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more dead stuff.